Okay. Yeah, it's party time, guys. All right, guys, got the man party. I'm just gonna scale them and clean them, and I'm gonna go pick it up at my grandma's house. All right, got the mempachi and they're all cleaned as you can see. And I'm just gonna take them out to my grandma's house to cook. And here we are at my grandma's house. Aquaponic system. be enough with with a spoon you see just peel the ginger with a spoon and it comes out real easy and comes out very clean so You're going to just dilute it in water, okay? So that it'll, when you put it in the soup, it won't be lumpy, yeah? So you're gonna mix this um, miso. Hey, this is ready. So bring everything over here. Okay. Soup base, yeah? These are soup base. So this one, it tells you how to make miso soup over here. So if you want three servings, then you use one packet. So this is about more than three servings, so you gotta use a little bit more. Okay, so that, it gives you the directions right over there. Okay, but we want to cook the tofu first. I'm going to get it boiling. Okay, so the tofu is it's boiling, so I'm going to put the seasoning in. This is the soup base. And the tofu is cooked. See, it's starting to boil again. And once the miso boils, I put the fish on. I'll put some green onion on and cover it. And then some of the green onion is for later, you know. So, okay, there we go. It's boiling pretty good now. So I'll put one fish and two fish. All right. Well, lucky I took some of the water, okay, out. water out. Put a little bit of green onion in there. Turn the stove off and we cover the fish. That's it. There we go. Now you can see the fish like that. And then we'll put a little bit of um, extra green onions on it. Just like that. Finished product of the Mempachi miso soup. Mm. Cooks pretty good. Go. Steamed. Looks nice. Now we're gonna go and fry. What we're gonna do is we have to dry that fish. Side and out. And okay. Put 
get some slits in here. Salt right into the cavity. So rub it in here. Put some on this fish. Oh! <laughs> cavity. Put some pepper on it. Use a fry pan then, so always put it to the side so that, you know, this thing sticking out, you won't knock it, yeah? Sometimes, you know, you're doing something and you don't realize. So you put some oil in here, not that much oil. Okay. That's enough to fry it. Okay, just let it get hot. So I'm going to put a little bit of flour on the fish, okay? The skin gets really crispy when you put flour on it. But you don't want to put too much, but just enough flour. There we go. <laughs> you want to try this fish, Vance? Mm -hmm. Try this one. Never tried my pachi before, Brown. There it is. delicious thank you so much <laughs> for watching yep great <laughs> <laughs>